There are a lot of tricks for learning multiplication tables. One of my favorite is to use your hands to solve problems from 6 times 6 to 10 times 10. The first step would be to number your fingers. The thumbs represent 6. The next fingers are 7, 8, 9, and 10, represented by the pinkies. By the way, I do not usually write on my fingers. I only did that to help you see what's going on. So now let's try the problem 7 times 8. So I take my 7 finger on one hand and my 8 finger on the other, and I touch them together. Then I curl down my fingers up to my pinkies. The fingers that are still up, I count by tens. So that is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. I have 5 fingers up, so it's 50. Then I look at the other hand. i got 3 fingers here and 2 there. I multiply those together. 3 times 2 is 6. So I add those two numbers together. 50 plus 6 is 56. So 7 times 8 is 56. Now we're going to try the problem 8 times 9. I touch my 8 finger and my 9 finger together. The fingers behind them curl down to the pinkies. Here I've got 7 fingers up, so that's 70. Now look at the fingers that are curled down. I have 1 on this hand and 2 on the other, so 1 times 2 is 2. So I add the 70 plus the 2 and get 72. So 8 times 9 is 72. For my last example, I'm going to try 6 times 7. Find the 6 finger on one hand and the 7 on the other and touch them together. Curl down my fingers to the pinkies. I have 3 on top, that's 30. On the other side, I have 3 on one hand and 4 on the other. 3 times 4 is 12. It's okay that this is more than 9. This second step will sometimes affect the tens digit of the solution. We just need to add it up like usual. 30 plus 12 is 42, so therefore 7 times 6 is 42.